Like every time I hit record for MHA, it just feels so cataclysmic. But it's good. It's just hype. Scared hype. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss for I should know. We have episode 126 of our MHA watch through called Final Performance. I gotta lie, Final Performance is a bit daunting of a title, but we really are at what I believe is the climax or the peak of this entire attack, assault, fight, whatever you want to call it. The villains' backs are really against the wall, and I have absolutely no idea what Sugar Rocky's next move is. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big white bell, and let's hop into this bad boy. <laughs> They're like all disappointed in him, even though bro's body's been the hell and back. I'm gonna be honest, Mr. Compress, you haven't done a whole lot from what I've seen. But I guess Shigaraki is the leader. Kinda is on him. But dude, pull your weight, you know what I mean? Oh. Wait, is this just like, is this compressed focus? Is this what I wanted? Creature Rejection Clan? There's a lizard. Bro, just start robbing them? <laughs> right in front of them, Chicka Chad. I don't know if this is Sugar Rocky's theme or just a League of Villains theme in general, but it goes hard. <laughs> I mean, the, the place on the outside did not look great. She didn't even get any of their blood. Kind of sad seeing twice again. I kind of forgot they were pretty down in the dumps for a while. Yeah, he's just limit testing people so you're strong enough. Exactly. The classic Todoroki way. So he was inspired by Stain too. Oh. 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 Yeah, they... he's still in prison, right? It inspired him. <laughs> Damn, Dobby. Yeah, there's no way they're getting part-time jobs, right? It is a narration from Compress. It's kind of bizarre. Like, he's about to have some moment. It seems like he is. Either that or just one perspective for both of them. Bro, it's like squeezing them to death. He has to touch the cable. Oh, he's going to touch the cable. Oh, he touched himself. Oh, my God. Damn. Hey, right, that's pretty metal. He deserves to break out after that one. All right, yeah, well, he is about to have his moment. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, you got to respect that one. He's bleeding from the eyes. What's got to do with that Uchiha curse? She's going to keep breaking parts of himself. Oh, my God. Bro is just removing parts of himself. Well, compress his metal. Holy. He doesn't have much time left doing that. No, dude's getting backstory, dude. He's done. Oh, like a Robin Hood. Yeah, like a Robin Hood. Oh, he taught Compress. Oh, his father. Ah. God, you kind of like, I don't know. I hate whenever it tries to make me feel bad for like how the villains are brought up and stuff, but it's just like the, the sincerity of fate. It's just unfortunate how things ended up this way. He's a stepping stone for Shigaraki. Oh, great, great grandson. Oh, shoot. He's demasked. He looks pretty normal. <laughs> it is his, his grand performance, his final performance. 
He is going to try to just get them all out of there. I mean, they both recognize that they just need time to make it for Sugar Rocky to wake back up, and he's not waking up anytime soon, it seems. I think there's like a sacrifice play by Compress. Oh my gosh, all the heroes just on the ground. And Mirio showing up was a lot, but... Bro, who are... Oh. Well, I was going to ask who he is, but Master Driller is... Oh! Yeah, no, nope, yeah, he's done. What a way to go out, though. Gone, but not forgotten. What a badass. Deku? Is it the first talking to him? Oh my gosh, I didn't know he passed out again. He was using the frothy black whip. Wait, so he passed out when Endeavor fell. Wait, so he doesn't know Mirio's here, does he? I thought that was a different user awakening. Oh? Oh, soon! Danger sense? Is it like spider sense? Okay, so I was right. It wasn't Makia, Makia originally. It was another awakening. It like lets him know something's coming. How is Bro able to move? He just has chunks missing. Free head mission? Oh, damn. But he didn't let him finish. <laughs> yeah, but he did for a bit, but it didn't even matter. I mean, Makia's down too. Makia's knocked out. I guess he doesn't need Makia. He has like every quirk. He has all for one. Okay. You can get them out of there easier. That's so sad. He obviously sees his great great grandpa as, the, as a star. He doesn't get that sort of highlight. It's like he recognizes it. He's gonna put the hands on! You wake him up! Or just the one on his face. He doesn't have on. <gasps> Oh, shoot! He did. Honestly, it's not a bad plan. It calms him. Oh, no. Not Lamillion. Oh, what? He's waking up, but it's like an aura? Deku! Get up, pal! It is kind of like It's like he sees him coming. He's able to know that he's coming, that he's awake again without even seeing him. Oh, that's all for one! I think, did he like take over him? He's juiced! Dude, how much of Homura is left? Doesn't seem like much. It's his face too, it's all for one's face. They all have a sort of a, a hub again. Yeah, he's awake. God, it really puts it in perspective how big Machia is sometimes. Dude, his eyes! Oh my god, it hurts to just look at! Oh, even though he's up. It, I mean, Compress's job was to get him out of there. It wasn't to push forward. Yep. Who are you? He was at like 60%. There's literally no part of Tomura left. It's all all for one. Uh, yeah, I'm not shocked. They're just pawns to him. They're not pawns to Sugar Rocky, but they're for all for one. Things are somewhat wrapping up. It's pretty much both sides wanting to withdraw to a certain extent. No, no, dude. They did not bring him back. Just to get rolled. He's so OP. Oh, no. I mean, he's not leading an attack. They're just trying to stop him from leaving, but they, there's there's just no, no, no possibility. Oh, goddamn, Best Genius is such a dark horse, man. What are you doing? Bro has no arms. You have to appreciate it. Oh, wait. God damn, you actually like whipped him. Meet again, his body is complete. I don't, that, yeah, that, that, that'd probably be disastrous. Oh. 
Damn, so that I think they say like before this he could have actually. Maybe he was. Oh my god, wait, this is actually beautiful. Genus! Dang, I ain't gonna lie, guys. We got rolled. Absolutely smacked. I don't think anyone, like, died. Dude, even Torino's alive? Oh my gosh. Can Hawks' wings regrow? Or is it, like, permanent? That's Midnight's. So quiet. So that's it. That is that. That kind of concludes this entire fight that has, that has been going on since the beginning of the season. I would say when, when did this start? A quiet beginning? Yeah, 114. About a 12 episode fight just all across the board. Oh, crazy performances by everyone. But what a beautiful way to end it. Very, uh, I would say bittersweet, but it's not really sweet at all. Yeah, they did put up a good fight and were able to stop him from just uh, taking over the entire world. But I think it really put into perspective how just outmatched they are especially if shigaraki is able to get to 100 i think it's all scaling up to eventually be like deku is the only one that would be able to stop him because it, i mean maybe within the entire arsenal of all the one for all powers he could and i think it's still focusing on that entire thing where deku is that type of person to try to look for the good in someone no matter what and he still was in shigaraki until the very end there the very end where he severed that he was like i can't anymore like this it's just it's so beyond that but man what a what a stellar arc and i i don't know even know how they're gonna do another half of the season i think we're only halfway so it'll be interesting to see all the dynamics and how everything changes based on this attack and going forward next episode is going to be very interesting guys that's been it for episode 126 of our mha watch through called final performance do drop us up on the channel if you are new and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace